Hi, everybody. College football is finally back. I'm Dave Calabro. We are in Bloomington. Indiana Hoosiers opening on the road against Florida International this weekend. Are you winning just five games last year, trying to take that next step this year? Taylor Tannenbaum joins me. New look for the Hoosiers on and off the field, right? Year two of the Tom Allen era. Like you said, another year to build on that five-win season. A lot of improvements have been made in the offseason, including the south end zone. Behind us, a couple of seats added. They closed that one off. But also, a new look for this team on their jerseys as they take the field this season. A little bit of a different look this year for your team. There's not going to be names. What went into that decision and why? Well, for me, you know, it fits with the core values of who we are. You know, and we started talking about as a staff in the offseason. And, and when we say uh, um, the LEO, which, which underneath that, is, it says it's not about me and we don't care who gets the credit. And so it's about playing for the name on the front. And I get it. You know, I tell our players that when you, when you make plays, they're going to know who you are. Another decision made this week after a battle throughout fall camp. Peyton Ramsey will trot out as the Hoosiers starting quarterback this season. Is it a win off you to now know who the guy is and you can tell the team and you can just move forward from that? I think so, you know, just for a lot of different reasons, you know, I think uh, for him personally, you know, but even for the, the guys that are in that room as well, you know, they just know what the role is right now and what the expectations are. We get a chance to sit down with all of them and talk that through. And so, you know, bottom line is, is that uh, Peyton's earned the respect of his teammates and, and his both performance on the field and the way he conducts himself off. This season, Tom Allen has stressed the importance of finishing, finishing plays, drives, quarters, and ultimately finishing games. But it all starts on Saturday against FIU. Yeah, very, very young football team. You know, I think the 14th youngest team in the country right now. And uh, so I just think that uh, um, that, that the, how you begin, you know, lay a good foundation. You know, when you got guys haven't been in these positions, you're going to have to get their, their feet wet and get them grounded and see how they respond when, when things don't go their way because there, there's going to be adversity in the game. There always is. And so, but so how you start is big, is critical, but how you finish is more important. Been smiling all week because college football <laughs> is back. The Hoosiers are away this weekend, but we'll be back September 8th when they take on Virginia right behind us. Can't wait, can't wait. Go to our website, WTHR.com, for more college football coverage. With Taylor, I'm Dave. Have a good night.